Hello everybody, my name is Ray, and today we are here to play some more Paper Mario Color Splash, and I found out off-screen that apparently literally every time you go to the overworld map, you... Ruddy Road, okay, yeah, literally every time you go to the overworld map, it saves, so that's gonna be kind of problematic for my, um, videos, hoping that they don't just auto-save, and then I have to redo the video, because I don't have to do that all over again, but that kind of sucks, but anyway, let's get into the Ruddy Road, apparently, part number three, Monday's episode, um, I have no idea... <laughs> How long this game goes, or how far it is that we're gonna be able to go, but we're gonna. This is where the red mini mini paint star led us. Ready road. Okay, Mario, let's look for the next paint star. Okay, easy enough. So we found out quite a few mechanics of this game last episode. Apparently, pretty much beating anything will drop out some paint, which is good. And apparently, paint is literally the lifeblood of this place, which makes sense. It's called color splash, but still, can we? I don't know why he keeps acting like he's going to fall off when he's obviously not going to. So we got a hammer. I wonder if we're ever going to get any upgrades to the hammer. I'm going to assume so. Oh, cool. Fire flower. And another worn out raggedy boot. I saw something back here. Wait, why is there paint just on the floor? Again, no complaining here. Just not sure why it's there. I was going to say that was kind of obvious. It looked like... They usually do things like that in Mario games. Can I? No. Okay. Oh, well. Yeah, okay, look. I'm going to have to get used to this. I really am. Let's see if we can't paint this entire house. Oh, uh, well, we'd be able to if I didn't suck at aiming where the paint's going to go. Yeah, that's going to be kind of problematic, I think, anyway. Can we? Okay, just a little bit more. Well, just a little bit more on the roof, rather. Oh, I missed some. Oh, of course I did, and I'm almost out of red paint. What's going to happen if I completely just... Here we go. Here's that. Oh, I think I need to... If I screw this up, then I apologize, I guess. Oh, that's good. Although, not really. Looks like you don't have the right color paint to paint this spot. Try smacking some flowers and trees to get... Yeah, I was, yeah, was planning to. Like I said, I need some red. Wow, it doesn't take very much to fill these things up. It really just doesn't. I'm glad, though. I'll take it. It's not a problem at all. Go ahead and break this, or I need to paint this place. Can you paint the proper thing, please? Jesus Christ. Come on, Mario. Are you serious? It, it, it looks like I'm finished. More or less, anyway. Do I have to get this window? I don't... I don't know. Maybe I gotta come back. I'm not really sure. I'm really not sure, because to me it looks like it was done. Like I said, maybe I'm just wrong. Maybe I'm just a doofus, and I thought this would break those. Which is why I avoided them before. Give me some blue? Yeah, I figured as much. Like I said, there's something back... Oh, okay. Oh, is this what I need to do? Okay, apparently it is. No. Get back out there, dude. I need all that stuff. I'll take it. Good. I'm trying to do the spin dash thing. Anyone who's ever played um the first Paper Mario will know there's a spin dash that you can do if you end up getting a certain badge. I wonder if badges take place in this game or have any have any place in this game. Okay, what the crap? I'm free, I'm free, finally, 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 I'm free, okay, goodbye, everybody. Oh, hey, Mario, we were all on a walk together when some shy guys showed up, so we all hid in this house. But somehow the door got jammed, and we all got stuck in there. It got pretty awkward, and I'm probably going to move to a new town. Anyway, thanks for saving us. Okay, I mean, that's almost weird, but I'll accept it. Obviously, we have to go in here and check if there's anything in here. You guys already know this. What the hell? Oh, Mario! I was just lounging around my house and all of a sudden a gaggle of toads forced their way in. There wasn't any space left, so I had to cram my way into, into that bureau in my own house. Looks like they all left, though. Thanks for getting me out of here. Here, take this. Ooh, an ice flower? Not bad. So I'm just, I'm just going to take all your paint, if that's okay. I'm legit just going to take all your paint. See, it pays to explore. I could have very easily just skipped... I mean, it doesn't... Wait... Hope those toads realize breaking and entering is a crime. 
can't you like rest them or something? You're Mario. Well, I mean, I literally just did the exact same thing. But yeah, I like how they gave me fire flowers and um, for that one flower over there, I got a fire flower. And for doing that, I got nice flowers, the ultimate reward. I could have very easily have just gone past all that. And it really wouldn't have mattered, all things considered. Because none of that stuff seems pertinent to the advancement of the game. Unless, of course, there's a certain enemy that has a major weakness to that. Oh, I will take that. With absolute joy. I like the music to this place, I think. I can't really hear it. Again, because my mic is turned down. Well, not my mic. The audio on my game is turned down. Just so that way I don't accidentally get too much of it on my... The hell? Worn out jump time. Okay. I mean, I'll take that. I mean, not at all what I expected, but I'll take it. I don't like that flimsy... Wait. What the heck is going on? I don't like that flimsy bridge I just crossed. So these morons are literally just drinking up the paint anywhere and everywhere. How is it that they can just do that? I'm going to try out that fire flower I just got. Alright. No, I don't want to run away. The fire flower is already painted, so I don't need to do anything else. I just want to see what this will do. I'm assuming it's going to hit everybody for a decent amount of damage. Wait, what? That was terrible! Oh, God. Okay, that was actually quite dangerous. But yeah, no, that, that, was, that was absolutely horrendous. I thought the Fire Flower would do more than that. What the crap? So what exactly is the point of doing that? It didn't do... It didn't do anything. Like, it literally... It, it, it didn't even kill the first guy. Which is really sad when you consider the fact that... Um, I mean, hell, my worn-out boot right here can kill him in one shot, provided I don't screw this up. And I screwed it up, because he's still alive. Oh, he just fell. That's funny. What, okay, why did he fall? I thought the first dude fell because... Okay. Whatever. Worn out boot again. Card ready. Done painting. So can I use the um? I wonder if I can use the item recovery one. Well, the health recovery buttons. Not buttons. What the hell? The health recovery items on the overworld screen. Why do these guys keep falling? What is the point? You are absolutely no threat to Mario or what he does. Um, I wonder if the worn out hammer can kill this guy in one shot. Maybe the slurp guys have more life than the regular shot guys. I swear we were killing these dudes in one shot before. Oh, it doesn't give you the prompts anymore. I don't know why I just noticed that. Okay, so you three are dead. And they stole the paint. Uh, it's a nice thing that you guys didn't... They're making a break for it. Yes, they are. Don't let them get away. I will not. They're sucking the very life out of this beautiful... Yes, they are. And it's fine, because we're going to get them. We are going to get them. What the hell was that? Why did it look like that paint was... Did I just pick something up? It doesn't really matter. I'm confusing myself, much less you guys. Yeah, so now I guess I got to refill this up. It'll probably be easier if I just use... That, um... If I just use that bucket, if possible. Oh, cool. I will take that... Wait, what? Did they actually expect me to have 40 damage? I know they went that way, but I want to go this way unless the stupid, uh, unless Huey wouldn't let me. Okay, it's a safe spot. A heart that I don't want anything to do with. It's another one of those weirdos. Huh? He hasn't noticed us. This is our chance to get the jump on him. You jump on him. Yeah, we know this. You can change your battle controls in the menu. The advanced controls allow you to set up and paint cards in one step. What would be, what would be the point of that? I mean, not that it's a bad thing, but why would I... Why would I need to um, do it in one step? It, it it almost seems pointless. You know, let's go back. I don't want to use I don't want to use this one. I'm gonna use one of the worn out hammers or worn out boots or something. Okay, we'll use a worn out boot then. Card ready. Paint that worn out boot. Done painting. Flip it up. Stomp his life in. Stomp his guts in. Yeah, you're gone. You're gone, son. Ain't nothing you can do about it. We're at 300... Oh, okay, never mind. I was going to say, is that the maximum you can get? Because 300 seems like an oddly specific number. 
Um, I'm gonna paint this a little bit before I try and pick up the red. I don't think it goes anywhere, and I am terrible at this. Another worn out hammer. That one's already. Oh no, it does. It does. It does. It goes away. Nice. Worn out hammer times three. What is the point of them giving us these times three things other than the fact? I mean, like right now they seem relatively pointless. Um, no, nah, they went this way. So I'm gonna go over here and get the shy guys real quick. Because I'm not trying to let those doofuses get away. And yeah, no, unless we run into an area later where paint is just not at all plentiful, it seems kind of pointless. Um, to give us these paint restrictions like it actually matters. Hey, it's a yellow shy guy. Because for now, we're just getting paint everywhere, so even when I use a bunch of it, it doesn't really matter. Oh, he called a buddy. Yes, yes, tap the bottom screen. Let's, let's do this. We're gonna go over here, get our worn out boot. And there's probably going to be a point in time, um, wait a minute now, there's probably going to be a point in time where I'm just going to go ahead and just have absolutely none of these terrible ones, like the worn out boots and the worn out hammer. Now again, I'm going to assume that you can get better slash more, um, what are they called? Better slash more powerful cards? Because th these can't, these can't be the only ones that we get. This is just the very beginning of the game, so it's not like I'm expecting anything extravagant, but still, come on now. Take it, take it. See, it looked like all his paint was gone. I, I like how they basically got built-in life bars, too. It looked like all of his paint was gone in the first stomp, that one. Which, again, is weird. Hello? Yellow Shy Guy. Is that like a friend-slash-ally kind of thing? I doubt it. Why the hell would a Shy Guy help me? I wonder if there's a limit. Yeah, I see you guys in there. We dances in circles, we start up to paint. If you think that you think that's your business, trust me, it ain't. Okay, so what are these paint guys now? Bucket men. No, nope, paint guys. Okay, I was right. Um, I know I said I didn't want to use these, but let's try the triple one. Let's try the triple worn out boot. Just to see if it actually does anything. Okay, that was terrible. Oh, never mind. So, okay, so it literally just... Oh! I get you. I get you, big dog. Okay. Wow, he actually did quite a bit of damage. So it, it goes consecutively. So even if I kill... I like that. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. I do I do take that into... I do take that into consideration now. I thought it would just be three on the same guy. Which is why I said, what's the point? It seems kind of like a waste. But if he just keeps going, if he kills the first one, if I do the first one correctly, I kill him, then go to the second one, then go to the third. Not bad. I mean, hell, at this rate, I should have, um... At this rate, I should have me some extra... What is it? Some extra capacity. Probably 200, maybe? But I see these toads over here. Or this one toad. My bad. I thought that that was, um... Again, with the Paper Mario 1 references, I... Oh, there's a blue paint star up there. Is that a mini star? That's probably the end game result of this place. So what's up? Talk to me. Oh god. Sorry, I had to sneeze real quick. Greetings, Mario. I'm the captain of the Purple Rescue Squad. Alright then. Received reports that people are ha having... I thought I said hanging for some reason. Having trouble getting past this cliff. We mobilized to see if we could find a way to scale it. Unfortunately, none of my three squ squaddies have arrived yet. They should have been here by now. If you run into any purple squaddies anywhere, send them my way, yeah? Over and out. You rescue squad guys. Are, oh, you rescue squad guys is so cool. I love the color coordination setups, and your scarves are choice. Thank you, but serving in the rescue squad is more than just wearing a cool uniform. Our mission is to right the wrongs of this world, to stamp out injustice wherever it festers. If you ever want to talk to our chief director, you can find him at Rescue Squad HQ in Port Prisma's Yellow District. Cool. So, I need to find... Can I... It, just, it looked like cardboard, but still, I figured I'd try. Um, so, apparently, this dude's got some squaddies that we need to find and bring back to him, which is not a problem at all. I enjoy the idea. I still don't like these flimsy little bridges, though. We already went down here and finished all this up. I don't need that heart, so I'm just going to leave it there. That cardboard heart, and I'm going to just hope that it stays there. I wonder if this is the first level, because technically... Eh. Beware of paint thieves. Alright, I don't know why I thought that that would actually do something. He'll probably come to life at one point or another. I won't be surprised a little bit. I mean, heck, they've they've done that in a lot of these Paper Mario games. 
There it is. There's a mini paint star over there. It's like only a quarter painted. That was easier than I thought it would be. Grab and grab it so we can show us the next. Okay, but yeah, seriously, it's not. Oh, he's super duper happy, and I doubt he'll let me go anywhere. All right, let's go. Can you jump up, please? What the hell? Seriously, there's like no paint on this, though. Huh? But why didn't it go flying off when you touched it? Hold up. What in the lo what in the lost levels? Is that a reference? What in the lost levels is going on here? Look, look, the color it's been... Yes, yes, we know this. This is a sick world we live in. That punk! Why can't I just... After him, we'll make him pay for this. Okay, so Huey is not, apparently not an enemy you want. I mean, he doesn't seem like a very nice guy to screw with. Or, is, is it a guy? Name's Huey. It could just be a, could just be a pun slash ploy off of, you know, hue, like hues of color, but uh, I'm not entirely sure. Um, I was going to say, I don't know if I actually need to fight these guys. They're all standing in line, nice and neat and organized, so, I mean, I like how the toad is in the background, but all the other shy guys that we found are not. Use some more, no, 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 go back. So apparently if we do more painting on it, I believe they said that it makes the cards do more damage. You about to find out. Well, not really, actually, because provided I don't screw this up. Yeah, like, he's done. Easy, so. Oh, oh, hold on. Really? I can just beat on this guy? Is this line even moving so bored? Is this that cafe with the really overrated coffee? Can't wait to waste my hard-earned coins on it. Seriously, can I just kill y'all? Why did that guy in the back? I was so excited about being first in line that I forgot I'm allergic to coffee. Look, Mario, you may have saved all of our lives countless times, but that doesn't mean you can cut in line. I'm not trying to cut in line. Okay, whatever. I'll fight you idiots eventually. Oh, well, alright, he's gone. Goodbye, Mr. Sh- Ooh, hello? I don't want to hit that other one now in case it's kind of the same thing. Hit the daggone- Another worn out hand- I'm getting actually kind of sick of these worn out items. Yep, it's the same thing. They seem incredibly pointless. Hey, it's a Koopa! Oh god, is he an enemy? He probably is. We've not seen them yet. Okay, I kind of thought that I was just being a jerk because he didn't do anything to me. Oh, here it goes. Um, how do I switch? Do I have to attack him in the front? I'm in my shell, biting my time. That's fine, but I, I want to attack... I want to attack the other guy. That's fine. We'll just we'll just use this one. It's really not a problem. I'm just wondering why the hell he won't come out. <clears throat> the hammers are probably what we need against this guy, to be honest with you. I wouldn't be surprised. Oh. Okay. I don't know why that happened. But I will definitely... Okay. Good God. That's a lot of stuff. Why did this thing just fall over? Seriously, I need to recharge my mic after this recording session is over. Well, it's not really a session, because it's just going to be this one episode. I'm recording this on Sunday, so it'll be ready by Monday. Or ready tonight, so that way when I go to work and I come back, I'll have time to render it and do all the stuff I need to do, and then get it uploaded. Hello, I hit the wrong button. And I can't get over this, I'm going to bed. Okay. Because Mario is useless. Why does that guy have a freaking propeller hat on? Tell me that's not like a propeller guy or something lame like that. I wouldn't be surprised. So what happens? I mean, there's not as many paint spots in this town or in this place. Oh, he's got a spike on his head. Why the hell did I think that was a propeller hat? Yeah, no, I'm not going to jump on you because I'm not stupid. I know how that works. So we're going to use our hammer on this guy. Uh, we're going to just use a regular hammer. I do have a triple one, but I'm not going to use that on this guy again. That seems like something more fitting for a boss or something like that. Then again, of course, considering the fact that these guys are made out of paper, their stupid whatever is probably made out of paper too. Sure, we'll use this one. Cards ready, done. Painting, flip it up. This is actually not a bad mechanic. Again, this does make me think a lot about um, 
Mega Man Battle Network, the series. Anyone who's never played that, you probably should. It's a good series, in my opinion. If you like Mega Man, obviously. If you don't like Mega Man, stay away. You'll have nothing but a bad time, because it'll probably be extremely boring to you. But that's okay. Oh, we got another boot. Seriously, they are really generous with these item cards. I only bought, what, two? And I'm nowhere near running out. I'm nowhere even remotely close to running out. Kill this fool. Alright, Mario. So let's let's take care of business here, like we tend to. Um, I don't know what... The, what will the yellow shy guy do? I don't want to use it, though, because I'm not entirely sure what it does. I don't want to use it on random... On just random enemies that don't do squat. Now, I mean, it's possible that um, he might help us by actually doing damage. It's possible that he might help us by bringing us something. Yeah, there are a lot of possibilities, but I'm just not wanting to use it on random enemies. Then again, it would be kind of stupid to use it on a boss if he doesn't do anything that I need him to do. So I do wonder, though, anytime that I see a colored shy guy that isn't red, do I have the potential to get their... I'm just thinking out loud, it really is kind of inconsequential at this point. Um, not what I wanted to do. Really? That, that, that didn't count? That didn't count as getting the whole thing? Okay, here we go. Bruh, I'm really, really bad at painting things. In a game where that's the main focus, that's kind of terrible. Come on. Like, seriously, I, I'm not good at aiming this at all. Another one of those hop slipper things. Okay. Is this the one? Is this the guy that's going to come to life? Beware of the incredibly handsome paint thieves. Yes, yes. Can I... I can't pull this. Oh, yes I can. Okay. Do it! That was easy enough. Alright, dude. Seriously, get off there. Like, seriously, you're not fooling anybody. Okay, you got me. I give up. I regret my life choices. No, you don't. I'll return the paint I stole. It's like they say, you can't fight City Hall or City Plumbing. What? Come on, sit back to the paint star, I, star thing after you, I insist. He's full of crap. You ain't fooling me, dude. You're gonna do something stupid. Seriously, I can't just... You're, you're not going to repaint it. If you do repaint it, I will be genuinely surprised. And why don't we just beat this dude and... Oh, you're going to call these guys, aren't you? Had a huge lunch rush and we're fresh out of everything. You're not, you're not going to call for assistance or anything like that? Okay, I will now unslurp the paint from... The <laughs> okay. You'll probably want to supervise me to make sure I don't try anything. Alright, dude. I don't like the way you said that. He actually repainted it. There, good as new. I'm surprised, yet I still don't believe you. So am I free to go? Or is this the end of the road? <laughs> um, oh, okay. Um, Mario, you need to run. You need to run with gusto. You need to get the hell. See, end of the road. He thinks he's, okay, what the hell? He thought he was funny with that end of the road. Okay, stop. I do not like this one freaking bit. How the hell am I supposed to dodge these things? Am I seriously just going to die here? Really? Bruh. Yeah, done, done, indeed. I'm screwed. Now what the hell? Um, what? Oh, that's the toad from the cafe. My bad. They rolled up right here road. my cafe is sky high. What am I supposed to do now? Somebody probably already owns the trademark for Sky High Cafe. Can't you, I don't know, unroll the ground somehow, Mario? Um, I have no idea. I mean, it looks like it's stuck to the ground somehow. It's no use hitting it from this side, so I gotta go around. But how am I supposed to... Can I... What the hell? Oh, I get you. I get you. Do it. Yeah. Okay. No, so that's not that bad at all. I was just going to say, Huey, uh, you might need to come out here and help me real quick. This is actually kind of bad. This is actually incredibly bad. You know what? Now I can use this. 
I'll take that. I wonder if they'll always give me 40. How do you increase... Oh, hold on. How do you increase Mario's uh, health, I wonder? And of course, I don't expect anybody to actually just answer it and tell me. I'm not entirely sure I like this either. Really? Okay, I can just... Hold on. Do your job, man! Oh, oh, dude. Seriously, don't do that. <gasps> I like how they became blue. That's hella funny. <laughs> no, Mr. My Caffeine gets away with it. Dude, you didn't do anything, though, so... It's kind of a 100% vague and empty... Man, you better. Kind of a 100% vague and empty threat. Never mind. He's gone, so maybe he's trying to take care of business after all. Now I realize I could just go get that... What the hell? Oh, Mario, good timing. Those mask guys may have tripped... What? May have tipped well, but I can't forgive them for what they did to my cafe. I'm trying to teach them a lesson, but I've been doing Pilates, so I'm not heavy enough to squat. What? I was thinking if we jump on them at the same time, we could give them a real stomping. Come on, please. Really? You want me to help you kill these dudes? Yes, yes, I know. Are you serious? I was gonna... That's actually kind of gruesome. I feel so much better after killing those guys. What the hell? Where's that one doofus who was up here? Grab that paint star, homie. Of course, clear. That was actually very uh, dramatic. Almost traumatic. I, literally just everybody died. And we took their literal insides. We literally just stole their guts. I'm not entirely sure I like where this game is going now. That was incredibly violent. No, I, I, I do. I'm, I'm enjoying this game quite a bit. Was that really the second course? Saving did not turn... Yeah, please don't screw this up. So, why is that purple dude there? What exactly do we do? Oh, God. There are circles everywhere. This game's going to be incredibly long. Maybe if this gets a good enough reception, I'll make this a Monday through Friday project because... Holy... Oh. Okay. Why does that star icon on the left kind of look like a being to me? Like the star could be the face and everything underneath it could be like an outfit, like a dress or whatever. And I'm thinking too much into this, I'm sure. But anyway, I'm going to have to end this episode here. So, thank you all for watching. As always, my name is Ray and I will see you all next time for Paint Burr Mario Color Splash Part Number 4. I was going to say Paint Splash Mario. Spin-off game, maybe? Anyway. Bye, everybody.